All right, guys, Hush Garden is Ahlan Wasahlan, and welcome. Welcome back to a new project. You can see on the screen here, we are going to be doing a clone of the White's IDX Pro. Um, this will be the first VLF machine that I've done, and I'm uh, looking forward to it. What we're going to do this morning is work on the power supply. So back with that next. All right, guys, let's take a quick look at the parts that we need in order to build the power supply. We have a 1N4001 diode, 10 microfarad capacitor, uh, 220 microfarad capacitor, 100 microfarad capacitor, a LM358P, um, a couple of 100K ohm quarter watt resistors, a 8 volt linear power supply and a 100 nanofarad capacitor and now let's take a look at the board alright guys this is just a shot of the printed circuit board populated thus far and uh, what we're gonna take a look at next are the voltages that we're getting from the output of the linear voltage regulator as well as pin 7 of the LM358 and that should be 4 volts for pin 7 and the output of the regulator should be 8 volts and that's stepping down from our 12 volt DC battery. Let's take a look at that multimeter. Okay we're gonna take a look at the output of the linear voltage regulator and uh, there we are 8 volts DC and let's go over to the LM358 and that would be pin 7 and that's pretty close to 4 volts if you ask me okay so let's wrap this up by having a quick look at the schematic and uh, see if there's anything interesting there to discuss. Alright guys, as promised, uh, a very brief look at the schematic. Um, right here we have our battery minus and plus. In this instance on this project, uh, battery minus is going to be the ground reference, okay? Uh, here's battery plus, we go through a switch right here, 4001 diode, some offering a uh, little bit of reverse polarity protection. Here we have our linear voltage regulator. I did not use this part, I used a L78 zero eight um, what else do we have here we have the LM358 and we have two 100k resistors okay so into the um, L7808 we have 12 volts out we have 8 volts positive okay and we go into this little network here with the 200k uh, resistors and we have a voltage division so we have a uh, four volts going into our LM358 and this is configured as a voltage follower what does that mean well essentially in this instance it means that uh, we're utilizing this as a buffer high impedance right and uh, so what we have for voltage coming in there's going to be no gain so it, it'll be times one gain and what we have coming out would be f four volts and you can see here there's no feedback resistor right so this is one of the hallmarks of a voltage follower op amp no feedback resistor. So we're going to get 4 volts 
out of this. And I believe that's all I have to uh, say for this project. And on to the next part of the IDX Pro.